The world of racing continues to move, churn rate is slowed and many events are having some fallow time. However, there's a feeling that the new dawn is just around the corner, domestically and now further afield. The Cape 31 and J70 are filling the void, but participation rates for other classes are low. There's a notion that the Rourke Admirals Cup in 2025 has ignited the kindling for the next cycle of big boat yacht racing and it'll be very exciting to see this progressing in the near future. Off your, offshore sailing is still the big adventure and in some ways less about the result and more about the adventure in contrast with inshore racing that is more focused on the result for much of the fleet. More exciting news for 2023 was becoming the UK dealers for Pegasus yachts. They build the relatively new and equally awesome Pegasus 50. Carbon build with a simple view and systems, a very comfortable and swift blue water cruising yacht with deck saloon with a very open plan living space that connects the cockpit and the saloon and galley. Ballast ratio is a very reasonable 39% with a very light displacement of 12, around 12,500 kilos. Close to being half the displacement of some other well-known blue water cruising yachts and around 20% less than her performance peers. An upwind sail area of just under 130 square metres gives a sail area to displacement ratio that knocks the socks off her peers. We're very excited to see what they can do. 2024 I think will be interesting domestically. Politically we have a potential change and financially there may be hiccups ahead driven by supply issue and conflicts. However, we prefer to look out of the sunny window and understand that whenever there's wind, there's a sailor looking at the trees bending.